Hi friends, uh, welcome to this video on Packet Tracer activity configuring secure passwords and SSH. Well, uh, here we can see the scenario. The network administrator has asked you to prepare RTA for a deployment before it can be connected to the network. Security measures must be enabled. Right. The topology here we can see uh, the router RTA. Uh, we will see the requirements uh, configure ip addressing on pca according to the addressing table yes here is our addressing table and uh, here we can see the device pca here is the ip address 10.10.10.2 and the submit mask and default gateway we will set this now now we will set this ip address on this uh, pca right here we will set 10.10.10.2 and the submit mask is 255.255.255.0 and we have the default gateway so 10.10.10.1 we will see the next requirements uh, console into RTA from the terminal on PCA right then we have to configure ip addressing on rta and enable the interface configure the host name as rta right and encrypt all plain text passwords so we have to give this command service password encryption right so we have to get the ip address of uh, rta interface so here we can see that uh, the device RTA interface is gigabit Ethernet 0 slash 0 and we have to set this IP address 10.10.10.1 Yes, here we can see this address we given as default gateway for this uh, device PCA Yes, now we will come to the configuration First of all, we will uh, console into RTA from this uh, PCA So here we have to come to terminal going to press ok right yes enable and the first we are going to set the IP address for the interface gigabit Ethernet 0 slash 0 so we have to go to that interface configure terminal interface gigabit Ethernet 0 slash 0 and we are going to set the IP address 10.10.10.1 and the subnet mask is 255.255.255.0 .255 and now we are going to enable this interface using no shut command yes now uh, we will set the uh, host name so here uh, is a host name as RTA yes now we can see the host name and uh, now we are going to encrypt all plain text passwords and they given the command for that that was service password encryption yes next is uh, set a strong secret password of your choosing right set the domain name to rta.com case sensitive for a scoring in packet tracer right we have to give uh, as it is uh, for a scoring in this packet tracer activity and here we can see that command in the global configuration mode we have to give ip space domain hyphen name space then we have to specify the domain name that is rta.com we are coming back to the console right so now we are going to uh, create a secret password and we can uh, set our own uh, password here as they mentioned so we are going to enable secret here we are going to give the password as i will mention cisco right so that we can remember very easily and now we are going to uh, set the domain name for that uh, we have to give ip domain name yes and the domain name we have to specify here we can see default domain name we have to give that name uh, as specified uh, that is rta.com next is yes create a user of your choosing with a strong password 
here we can see username then uh, we have to give a username then we have to set the password command i mean password command we have to give first then we have to set the password right uh, then uh, we generate a 1024-bit RSA keys here they given a note how to create this RSA in packet tracer enter the crypto key generate RSA command and press enter to continue yes here we can see that and uh, uh, we can set this 1024-bit uh, uh, RSA keys coming to the device RTA here we are going to keep username and uh, we are going to give any username here we are going to give administrator and now we are going to set the password here we are going to give the password as uh, uh, let me see cn right now we will uh, generate a uh, 1024 bit rsa keys so we have to use a crypto key generate rsa right so as they mentioned we are going to create 1024 bit rsa keys so we have to specify that yes next is uh, block anyone for three minutes who fails to log in after four attempts within a two minute period yes here is the uh, command for that login block for 180 attempts for within 120 right this is the command what we have to give then configure the VTY lines for SSH access and to use the local user profile for authentication. So we have to use line VTY 0 to 4. Then we have to give transport input SSH and login local. And then we have to save the configuration to NVRA. Be prepared to demonstrate to your instructor that you have established SSH access from PCA to RTA right so we will complete these steps now now we will uh, block anyone for three minutes uh, who fails to log in after uh, four attempts within a two minute period so we have to give a uh, login uh, then we have uh, yes block four and here we can see the time period in seconds so this is for a uh, three minute so we have to give 180 seconds and next is attempt how many attempts so uh, they mentioned four attempts and that within watch period for fail attempts yes so we have to specify within two minutes that is 120 now we will configure the vty lines for ssh access we have to go to line vty 0 to 4 and here we are going to give transport input ssh and login local right now we will save the configuration Con so we have to give copy copy running to startup yes yes now our device rta is ready for deployment so this packet tracer activity here we can see the completion status 100 percentage well uh, in this packet tracer activity we have seen uh, how to configure uh, secure passwords and ssh friends if you have any doubt uh, please comment below also if you like my video give a thumb and don't forget to subscribe the channel so that you will get latest uploading video info into your gmail Thank you.